I am definitely tracking and I am what Saturday Sunday Monday it is Tuesday of my first week back on tracking and I gotta be honest I'm already 27 points in the hole I've used all my weeklies and I'm 70 points over it's not good 91 points. That's a lot over. I mean, I wasn't eating great, but I didn't think I was eating that badly. First of all, Saturday, after my Weight Watchers meeting, my mother and I went to um, Silver Diner for breakfast, and we frequently go out afterwards because my dad loves to make Saturday breakfast. And Saturday breakfast at home, well, there's nothing good about that. Nothing, period. Coming right out of Weight Watchers, my mom and I both are kind of not wanting to eat the heavy gravies and biscuits while wonderful, not at all healthy. So we frequently go out and get a relatively healthy breakfast at, um, after our meeting. And so we stopped at Silver Diner and I got the roasted veggie huevos rancheros. And I get it without egg yolks, without cheese, and without avocado. And the avocado, because I'm allergic to it, and all of those things add a lot of fat and thus adding points. So the roasted vegetables, I, I, the whole meal, if you eat the entire meal that way is eight points. And I usually only eat about a third to half of it. So I was headed out in the right direction, doing really well, and then lunchtime came and Chick-fil-A. My dad and Mauricio had run out and run an errand and they decided that everybody in the house needed Chick-fil-A. So literally I looked on the menu and I was like, I don't even know what to get. So if you guys have any suggestions for what to eat at Chick-fil-A that is Weight Watchers friendly, let me know because I ended up getting like their plain chicken sandwich with no mayonnaise, no dressing, no cheese, no nothing, just a piece of chicken and bread. And then I put lettuce, tomato, and pickles on it at home. Dinner, um, we went to my sister-in-law's church. In Hispanic churches, it's like a multi-hour event. So afterward, there was food and we had tamales, Colombian tamales, and they were excellent. Those aren't too bad. It was small, so it was only about eight points. But I had a Cosmopolitan. Cosmopolitans are seven points. And there are a couple of things that I notice always throw me over with points. Alcohol, and oddly enough, my milk in the morning. I have a half a cup of milk in my coffee every morning because I like super milky coffee. And I have three cups of coffee a day. So that's a, a cup and a half of milk. and drinking skim milk that's five points that's a lot of pointage so the next day it's all the eating out and the next day my dad took my mother and I out for breakfast it was a special occasion and he wanted to take us out for breakfast and the place that is his favorite is they have nothing healthy on the menu. So what I ate was a pretzel bread sandwich with egg whites and a side of grits. I ate half the sandwich and half the grits. And I think that whole meal ended up being a gajillion points. I, I counted it. That whole meal, the half of it that I ate was 18 points. 18, 18. Yes, if I had eaten the whole meal, 36 points. That's disgusting. That's more points than I get in a whole day. So yeah, 18 points. The day was shot. Originally for dinner, we had crab legs. And, and as you know, crab legs are super low in points. And so um, I, I did okay until Mauricio made margaritas. And again, it's the alcohol. It creeps in. It, it just starts creeping in. And then yesterday I did much better. I usually do a lot better during the week than I do on the weekends, but dinner, I made a poor choice. I, um, I was under my points pretty well until dinner and there was a sweet potato casserole and I thought it was going to be good because it was just, you know, sweet potatoes. No, it was sweet potatoes and butter and sugar. And so it just was bad, but 
the good news is I'm tracking and I'm writing everything down. So, you know, at the end of the week, if I maintain, which at the rate I'm going, the rest of the week should be pretty good. Um, I'll probably maintain this week, but, um, yeah, it'll, it'll help me going forward. The goal is track seven days this week. And so far I'm right on track where I should be. So I'll let you know how I do. It's the Friday before my weigh in and yeah, let me tell you how tracking is going. It's not going well. I am tracking. Yes, absolutely. I have tracked 100% so far this week and that is awesome. But I will tell you, I've used all my weeklies and I'm 70 points over. It's not good at all. So, oh, I am going to be going to Weight Watchers tomorrow and I will weigh in and I'll let you know, here's what I'm noticing. When I make my food for me and nobody else, I eat super well. I eat healthy. I, I do really well on program. But when I have to eat with other people, I eat what they like and not what I should be eating. So like for example, Mauricio was home with me and we were working on the deck and so I had arepas with eggs. And while not a horrible decision, it was not as good of a choice as my standard yogurt and fruit. I did have a salad for lunch, but then we pulled out the Cheetos and I had Cheetos and I, I will tell you, I tracked every single one of those Cheetos. I'll let you know how the week, the weigh-in goes tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. It's weigh-in day. I've been up since about five, got a bunch of editing done and now I'm going to Weight Watchers. I am nervous. The final total of points I was over, 91. 91 that's a lot of points. I have no doubt I am going to lose nothing today, but I'm going to go. And this is the beginning of a new phase. 91 points. That's a lot over. I mean, I wasn't eating great, but I didn't think I was eating that badly. So let's go. I'm here. I don't know why I'm so nervous. I was here last week. I weighed in last week. It wasn't that big of a deal. I think because I know this is a new chapter in my life. Hello. Oh. That's crazy. Holy crap. I was down two pounds. Yeah, tracking works, guys. Granted, I was like 90 points over. Imagine how much weight I would have lost if I had been within my points range. So, next week, same thing. I'm gonna track and I will report back to you. So, if you're new to my channel, make sure you click on my big laughing face and subscribe to my channel so you can follow all of my weight loss progress. Woo woo. I'll see you in the next one. See ya.